Okay, so we just want to do that. Uh, yeah, these mushrooms work like this. They can work as a little trampoline, like that. If you press down, you'll go a little bit higher. That's also how you're going to get some of the treasures. Watch out for the snail, but he's not really too much of a threat if you can just get past him. Also, getting the treasures in this level is actually pretty easy. You want to keep this uh, with you just for right now. Okay. And after that, do that. And also, those guys act as homing uh, things, so that helps you take out enemies a lot more faster. So let's just hit up here. Is there anything up here? Nope. Alright. Uh, I think you don't want to head down there just yet. Or maybe it doesn't matter. Because then again, there's this. Alright, so now we just want to do this. And the first treasure should be right up here. Go ahead and do that. And then after that, you just want to float on down. Okay, there we go. I got it. Uh, the way you kill these jellyfish things right here, you can either, uh, I think you can do this, yeah, do that, kill them that way, or you can, uh, press down B on them, it's an insta, well, it's an insta kill either way, but, whatever. Well, something tells me I want to keep that guy alive, that way I can use him as a stepping stone. Just out, watch out for the cotton he's gonna throw out. Okay, up here's the first treasure. Okay, let's do that. Okay, now let's try that again. There we go. Now I want to head all the way down here, and this gives us our first treasure. The mushroom bed. I'm sure Mario has one of those. There we go. Now we want to do that. That. Right, can, what can we use this guy for? Oh yeah, the next treasure is actually really close, too. Uh, I'm pretty sure we want to have uh, an enemy with us, so let me do that just to be safe. Can you get the beats here. No, come on. Get back up there. Thank you. Hey. Yeah, you kinda I kinda hate this part. It's not it's not hard or anything, it's just that you'll you're gonna fall off if you're not being patient, like I not am or I'm being impatient, whatever. Okay, we wanna bounce up here. Oh god. Okay. No. Well they'll give me another enemy up here if I look hard enough. Alright. I want to head over here. And this is our next treasure, the mushroom lamp. I thought I saw a platform down here, so I'm just going to go see. Yep. And it gets us another bonus patch. Sweet. There we go. And now we just want to float on over here, like that. Come down here. Now the last treasure to get is actually a little bit more uh, tricky, but it's not hard. What the heck? I guess that doesn't hurt you at all. Just weighs you down. Which, right here, that's not really a problem. Okay, so we just want to head over here. Do that. Uh, coming down on these mushrooms will send you at an angle like that. But if you just do it normally, they'll just send you upward. There we go, kill that guy. Right now we want to head up here. You want to. Go ahead and kill that guy, because he'll just get on your nerves. Alright, let's do that. Come up here. Some more beats up here. Kill that guy. We are near the, um... Yeah, the treasure's right there. You want to go... You want to try and get this, uh... Come on. There we go. You want to try and get this, uh, little guy over here, the snail. Let's float on down. Where'd he go? Great, I gotta wait for him to respawn. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. <laughs> he's, he's on the trampoline. That's actually pretty funny. Okay.
and now we're gonna get another very fun level, personally. Sweets Park. Yeah, this level is more than likely gonna make you hungry when you see what it contains. I don't know. The level itself has... I'm, I'm not gonna say really good music again, because, I mean, that's kind of redundant at this point. <laughs> uh, anyway, let's just go ahead and head this way. Just head up here, go ahead and uh, kill this guy. He tries to do a body slam at me, but he missed. Okay, so we just want to go ahead and pull that away, revealing a another big cake. Man, this is, uh, this has a, what's his name? Buddy, written all over it, for those of you who know what show I'm referencing. I can't think of his last name, it's like Vesultra, I don't know, it's Italian. You guys should know what, what show I'm referencing right there, because I love that show. Oh, <laughs> I can't hop on that, that's not a platform. I thought it was, so, that's my own fault. Yeah, sometimes this game kind of tricks you on what is a platform and what isn't. There's that, go ahead and break that open, get some more beads. This level is actually really fun. There's some cookies, I guess, but the game calls them donuts. Mm. Those look like a certain type of cookies you can get, like, uh... Like, they'll look like that design right there and have chocolate on the bottom. Yeah. And we got some chocolate donuts with sprinkles. Personally, I don't like sprinkles on my donuts whenever I have some. And here we have some... I don't know. Let's go and hide up here. Yeah, well, I guess we can't. Don't worry about those things crushing you, they'll just like squeeze you out and then uh, make you appear at the other side or whatever you're facing, I guess. Let's just do that. Well, okay, let me try that again. Oh wait, can I get up here from there? Okay, this is kind of tricky, I gotta time this just right. Okay, how the heck do I get up there? Oh, <laughs> that's an idiot. Okay, here you just want to do this, and drop down some beads right here. Just keep pulling these out and then pop up. Do that. Oh, jump. Here we go. Up here we got some more beads and I guess some more cake or... I know what those things are called, I just can't remember their name. I think it's flan. That's what it looks like. Chocolate covered flan. Because I'm... I'm there's a thing. There's an episode of Curse of Cowley Dog where like they get hypnotized by th by this guy with like has an obsession of flan, and it looks like that. So that's why I'm calling it that. Okay, we just wanna do that. Wait for the uh, flan to uh, get across here. There we go. No. Okay. Get on this and wait for it to drag us. I also kind of like the way it um like I guess jiggles whenever you land on it or something. Okay, we just want to do that, and this will get us our second treasure, correct? No, our first one, huh. I could have sworn that was our second, oh well. Well then again, we've not really gotten in depth in this level yet. Alright, let's just head more. I'm gonna get crushed there, there we go. Okay, let's head up here. Uh, nope, nothing over there. Whenever you get to one of these donuts, you want to stand on the inside of them, because most of the time they'll have something good. Okay, yeah, there is something over there I can make that if I probably go fast enough. Alright, let's try that again. There we go. Uh huh, that make you work for that right there. Alright, let's just uh, wait for this thing to open and I'll get the beads in here. I just love showing off all these levels. Level on again is just great. I don't care what Metacritic says, they give this game an 88, I think. It, it's a AAA, in my honest opinion. I mean, I have no faults with it whatsoever. Okay, if you head down here, there's some more beads, but... I'm not gonna waste you guys' time with that, because I've already got a gold ranking. Okay, nothing up there. Right here with some more... I guess some chocolate drizzled... Cut... Uh, I'm gonna say cutscenes. <laughs> cookies. Uh, let's go ahead and head down here. Do this. Okay, we just want to wait for this guy. Okay. And up there's a crystal star. There we go. Oh god, that was close. I thought I'd about kill myself right there. 
Okay, and here's some more beads. Let's just go ahead and get out. There we go. Okay, we just want to do this. Okay, let's head up here. Yeah, this next treasure can be kind of tricky to do if you don't know how to do it just right. Uh, let's kind of go in here first. This actually took me a long time to figure out how you're supposed to get this treasure, but I finally figured it out. Uh, yeah, when, as soon as you drop, you're going to become a mole. Uh, chomper or whatever. And you just want to kind of build a path to uh, to the to the treasure itself. Okay, I'm trying to think for a second. Alright, that should do it. Alright, I don't really care about those other beats again. I've already got enough. But I'll get these here just because I feel like it go. Now let's just go ahead and get out of that. And now you want to uh, climb back up here. One LP or I saw it do it this way. Uh, he tried to uh, make it to where you had to jump inside of a platform and then jump out onto the other platform. Like he, like there'd be two ways to cut right here and then after you got on this one you gotta jump out of it and over and then get on the next step. And he was having such a hard time with it so I decided to take his idea with that and um, do it that way. Well at least that's how I found out you can get that Alright, so, after that, you want to just go ahead and continue heading this way. Got some more beads, I guess. The final treasure is right over here. You want to just drop right in here and just make sure you don't fall. Just want to do this. Okay, after that, jump over here. No, no! Oh, pff. I, I was getting so nervous. I was like, my hands just about... Oh, man, I was so worried right there. Okay, now we just want to stand on this until the hole comes back. Alright. There we go. And now that's pretty much it for this level. All that's left for us to do is get to the end. Which is right up here, I think. Okay. There we go. Let's go ahead and just keep heading this way. And here's the end of the level.